there's a lot of criticism we know uh, about Belt and Road project compliance, about uh, environmental impact, about debt trap, and so on. Uh, actually, if you look and analyze it, uh, it is it is not. Uh, the, the case. 7月13号，世界银行前常务副行长、印尼前贸易部长冯惠兰在北京接受中新社记者专访时表示，“一带一路”倡议提出十年来，除开展大型基础设施项目外，中国还实施了一批小而美的民生项目，用事实对有关“一带一路”的诸多质疑做出回应。In the beginning, there were a few mega Uh, infrastructure projects like the Mombasa Nairobi Rail, uh, Euro China Rail. The in, in for Indonesia, it was the Jakarta Bandung High Speed Rail, uh, and there are a few others, uh, big mega projects. But then, in kind of in the second period, around uh, 2017 to 2019, uh, the projects were not just the mega projects, but became smaller and more priority uh, and more uh, strategic. As well as already addressing uh, clean uh, and green uh, Belt Road, right? So I think there was a lot of learning in those ten years. The world and development still needs a lot of infrastructure uh, for development, and, and now we are dealing with the climate crisis as well,、uh, as well as the challenge for digitalization. And those two are clearly part of the already part and going to continue to be an important part of the Belt and Road Initiative. 在全球范围内，共建“一带一路”正是越来越多的人享受发展红利。中印共建的雅万铁路便是“一带一路”倡议落地的样板。冯惠兰说：“当民众乘坐雅万铁路时，便能切身体会到‘一带一路’倡议带来的实实在在的好处。” The Jakarta Bandung Rail is just about to be implemented this year. I think people will start feeling the benefit. I would say that young people are quite proud that actually Indonesia has a high-speed train, and it was, you know, coming from Chinese technology. And I think I think there was learning from both sides, from the Chinese side as well as from the Indonesian side, when we were impl implementing these projects. A lot of learning about the regulations, about how to make sure、uh, we can bring along the local people, and how can you raise the skill level. Level uh, of uh, the local institutions as well as of the local engineers and so on, so that you can jointly operate and hopefully, and at the end, it'll be Indonesian as who who will be operating and maintaining、uh, this high-speed rail. 然而，当前全球性问题加剧，共建“一带一路”面临的国际环境日趋复杂。冯惠兰表示，未来“一带一路”倡议需要引进更多外部资源，通过开展基础设施建设、贸易便利化。投资流动、人员流动来改善互联互通，在“一带一路”大家庭内形成真正强大的供应链。One is、uh, South-South cooperation, right?、Uh, and that actually has been the、uh, the direction、uh, of Belt and Road, especially、uh, in the last、uh, few years. So I think、uh, focusing on South-South、uh, cooperation.、Uh, second,、uh, I think it's about bringing resources together. Uh, so that you can、uh, address the need. The need is so huge, and so how do you combine different resources, starting with BRI? And、uh, China also has this new initiative,、uh, Global Development Initiative, which can be co complementing、uh, the development aspects, the poverty reduction aspects that can go together with the BRI infrastructure projects. And you can have、uh, the multilateral、uh, development banks also come in,、uh, you know, including AIB, for instance. And then the last one, I think,、uh, given the challenge of climate crisis and the need for、uh, developing countries to either decarbonize, go out from fossil fuel to renewable energy, China should leverage、uh, the technology of low carbon technology for renewables as well as for electric vehicles, and and use that within、uh, the Belt and Road、uh, Initiative.